Senator Victoria, I'd like to hear your viewpoint on this in, in regards to technology and beauty. These technologies have existed for a long time when it comes to wellness, beauty, and medicine, but now these biotechnologies powered by AI are just gonna be growing at an exponential rate. So whereas things could have taken 20 years before, they will now take about a year. I think we're gonna see a massive shift. We're already seeing it in personalized medicine, genomics, at-home testing kits, longevity. Beauty is going to start to be something that's not just surface level, but more regenerative with stem cell treatments. And how do we get our own body to do what it needs to do, like stem cell injections versus filler. To echo what you said about AI, we can't deny that that's just changing literally everything. I read this article about companies doing what they call digital twins now. So medical companies, wellness companies can create a digital twin of you and see how you will react to certain ingredients, medications, what diseases are you most likely to get. Huge companies now are getting on that bandwagon like L'Oreal came out with something called BioPrint, which is essentially a lab on a chip and it shows you the cellular age based on the protein analysis, but also how it will react to all kinds of ingredients. This is just the beginning. We're only 2025 now. I can't imagine 10 to 20 years. I mean, it's actually hard to imagine what that'll look like.